Hey everyone, Kyle Prolix here, and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to replace the circuit board on our Prolix Central CV12000. So stay tuned. Alright, so the first thing we need to do is separate the vacuum from the dirt bin so you have a latch on both sides. And once that's done, you can lift the vacuum portion off and then go ahead and set the dirt bin aside. Next, we need to remove this top cover. There's going to be screws going all the way around it. Let's go ahead and remove those screws. Once you got the four screws removed, go ahead and remove the top lid. And then there's going to be this metal casing. If you have a flat head, you can kind of get underneath it and pry it up. All right, so here's the circuit board. You're going to have a bunch of wires coming off the motor to it. I recommend taking a picture of how the wires go. So when you go to reinstall your new circuit board, you don't mismatch the connectors or wires. So. All right, once you got the wires removed, we need to remove this foam piece. Okay, once you kind of got the foam out of the way, you're, gonna, you're going to need to remove this nut on the circuit breaker reset button. So let's get a pair of needle nose pliers. Go ahead and twist that nut off. Same thing with the low voltage connector. Go ahead and twist that nut off. Set those two nuts aside so you don't lose them. And then you can kind of just push the circuit board out with your fingers. Once you got it off, you're gonna have a connector at the bottom. Go ahead and just unplug that. Same with the blue one next to the low voltage. And then you're gonna have a brown one underneath this brown block. And that is how you remove the circuit board. Okay, so now you got your old circuit board removed, you can go ahead and throw that away, get your replacement. And at this point, it's just plug and play. So remember, brown wire goes below this brown block. The blue wire goes on to the side or next to the low voltage, okay? And then white one just goes at the bottom right of the circuit board. And this one will have all these different colored wires. They can only go in one way. Okay, so now that you got the connectors re-plugged into the circuit board, you gotta push the circuit breaker and the low voltage through the two holes on the actual unit. Low voltage at the bottom, circuit breaker reset at the top. Okay, once you got those protruding from the vacuum, go ahead and put those nuts back on and make sure they're pretty snug because that is what holds it onto the inside of the central unit. Okay, so now we just have to reconnect the wires to the top of the circuit board. A good rule of thumb, the black and white wire coming off the motor is going to plug in on the right side of the circuit board. White first, black second. On the left side of the circuit board are going to be the two remaining black and white wires. Black first, white second, and then you're going to have this wire one. This wire one right here is going to have green and yellow with a little sensor on it. So plug that in last. And then make sure this little hose is connected to that sensor. Okay, and then from here, you can go ahead and just put all the foam back in. And once you got the foam back in, you can then put the metal top part back on. And just make sure you put on the holes line up with the holes on the vacuum. And then you can put the black lid back on. Again, make sure the holes line up with the screw holes on the unit. Take your four screws and screw the top lid back on. And then go ahead and place your central unit back onto the dirt bin. And latch the dirt bin onto the vacuum. 
All right, that's gonna be it for today's video. Um, this is not a complex repair, but if you're not comfortable doing it, email us at servicecollectscleaners.com and we'll have you sent in for warranty. We cover warranty, shipping both ways, and we'll replace the part for free. Um, again, before you start unplugging everything, take a picture so you have a reference. But that's it. I'm Kyle Prolux. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.